that IIT Madras, there is uh, there is uh, mentoring at the departmental level today. It's not okay. at the institute level. There is uh, what you call more orientation, but there is mentoring at the departmental level. And I think making mistakes as a young faculty, I think, is part of the learning curve. I mean, I think there's enough uh, understanding in the system to let you make those uh, those genuine mistakes. And, uh, you know, kind of there are doctoral committees in place. There are senior faculty colleagues who who help. And so I think, I mean, it's not it's not a one shot, right? Research is incremental. Research is collaborative. So I think there's a lot of safety nets that uh, take you through these courses. We appoint a mentor for a cluster, like health cluster, agriculture cluster, engineering cluster, so that they mentor them. If there is any difficulty, hassle in recruitment or a, a, a procurement, he goes there, as well as professional development in terms of competence building in that area and connecting with people for interdisciplinary research. From our institute, we started doing it because it's a uh, very specialized institute of biomedical genomics. So we try to train people in this area. So we bring them here and then try to see how we can mentor them in this uh, particular field. When a new faculty candidate or new faculty has to go and make a presentation for their grant, uh, we would like them to make the presentation uh, to a small committee before they go out. And that has helped a lot in many cases. TIFR, we don't have any uh, specific stipulated body, but as such, uh, when anybody joins, is, there is always people who are working very close to it. So usually they form uh, on the on the game uh, a mentoring group. Um, we do have a sort of interventions sometimes when things are really going uh, very differently. For example, the dean or the director or the uh, or uh, some of the senior people uh, sort of uh, do actively take part. Like they say, somebody wants to buy a two crore uh, machine and it's not uh, easy how they can go about doing it. So we do uh, uh, sort of ask them to go and sit with such and such person who knows how to deal with these things, so on and so forth. So that kind of uh, things happen. Formally, if we if I talk about KIT University, we don't have such kind of thing called a faculty mentorship under that banner particularly. But yes, through all the systems, uh, the a faculty gets enough facilities to be mentored as far as teaching is concerned, research is concerned, establishing their own lab, coping up with the challenges of teaching and taking their research into the classroom, all those kind of things are possible. 